why I'm out there once again making it another great day. Today I am in Tampa, downtown Tampa, in the Heights District, and uh, a place called Armature Works. They have refurbished an old warehouse which used to house uh, the Tampa electric streetcars years ago. And they have made different rooms and kind of an eclectic place of all different types of foods and some small shops. And we're going to go back here and check out the Heights Public Market and look around a little bit, see some of these restaurants and see what all is in store. And there's still more coming. They're still building on this. This recently opened and hasn't been open very long. That's coming at you right now. I am just outside of Tampa Armature Works, a new area over here in the Heights District area. They have a Heights Public Market. Lots of eateries in here. This here is the outside patio area for a restaurant called Steelbach. Uh, they're not open quite yet, but a lot of outdoor seating and it's a very cool place. And I'm going to go inside of the Heights Public Market right here in downtown Tampa and check this place out. We're just inside of Armature Works here in the uh, Heights Public Market. Some pretty cool big fans up inside here. We're going to walk down through here and see what all we can find. I have found an interesting table here. <laughs> I'm not sure what that is. It's some kind of machinery, but it's they've made a table out of it. How cool is that? <laughs> That's some creative stuff in here. As soon as you walk into the Heights Market, there's a there's a big fireplace here, uh, probably used in the uh, factory that used to be here, or the warehouse. And uh, they have a thing over here called Show and Tell, which is a classes on how to do chef dinners and group outings. And you book that. That's pretty darn cool to have a little show and tell session here with a chef. Here they have on display at the Armature Works is uh, where they restored this building, which used to be the uh, warehouse where they stored the street electric electric streetcars here in Tampa. And uh, pretty cool they have this here on display as you walk in the door here at the Heights Market. It's a pretty big place here at the Heights Market. They have a coffee bar here and I'm walking around. Here's a pretty cool looking old table. And they have a little shop here and uh, all kinds of eateries and stuff down through here. They have restored this very nicely and I do like some of the tables here. These are pretty darn cool. Some of these places are not quite open yet. I also read they have a Filipino restaurant here called Chisholm's and Company and is serving Filipino type food. Everybody thinks outside the box but down here it's called inside the box and it looks like a deli. You can get some deli sandwiches and stuff. They have a pretty good sized menu up here. Chicken and the goat salad it says. That sounds interesting. Look at all these pastries out here for the taking. And the, and the purchasing. Ooh, I might come out of here with some cookies. These cookies are looking pretty darn fabulous here. And uh, they have all kinds here at this little market. Here they have all kinds of frozen treats. Here they have key lime pie. And uh, they got some puddings and stuff down here as well. Of course, they got a big selection of beverages. And they have artisan foods here, it says. All kinds of flan and different things. And, Fresh produce. Why well, I found something here called barrel aged maple syrup. It's grade A dark. Hmm, that must be some potent syrup. Uh, if it's barrel aged, uh, or if it's uh, you age that like a fine wine or a whiskey. When you need some sauce, you must tie. It's uh, Thai mustard. Mmm, I love mustard. But Thai mustard? That sounds interesting. I'm just roaming around here. It's like a big warehouse, and it did used to house the uh, electric cable cars here in Tampa. And there's a place here called Hemingway's, which is a restaurant, and Astro Ice Cream. <laughs> I wonder if George Jetson is involved with that. The Astro Ice Cream Company is not open, but they have a little video playing here. It says Vessels, a cup, waffle cone, granny apple crisp pie. Mmm, this stuff is sounding 
pretty tasty. And they also have bulk candy, it says. This here is Hemingway's. It's a little eatery, kind of eclectic uh, little place, little bar here you can set. They have tables as well. What a cool looking decor in this, this little market. Hemingway's also has a little walk-up stand here where you can uh, come out here and eat. That's pretty cool. It says they have classic, modern, and Cuban. That's probably sounding pretty darn good. Here's another angle. As you can see, they have some couches and stuff out here for you to relax as well. All different kind of eclectic furniture. And over here is a little bar called Unicorn. And right beside it is a, a barbecue place, uh, which has some fresh meat in the, in the counter there. And that looks pretty good. And right next to it, you can get pizza. They have red pizza, white pizza, and salads. And on down, there's another little bar. And uh, you see they have a ladder down there too. There's even a little courtyard back out here in the middle of this. As you can come out here, even more seating. It's like some old engines up here on the side of this wall. That's pretty darn cool. And if you drop down, there's an old washing area where you can wash your hands. It's one of the old type wash washing uh, areas and out here in the public and uh, down there is the foot pedals looks like inside of this case is remnants of the uh, electric cable car system you see some circuits and stuff in here and they've left it up that's pretty cool there's even another box of circuitry here on the walls in this old warehouse which is now Armature Works. Well, I have been offered lunch here at Ampa Mama's, uh, which is an empanada stand and tacos. This is their menu here at Ampa Mama's. They started out as a food truck. Now they have a full restaurant right here at Armature Works. They have the empanadas, they have the tacos, and they have the street eats, which is some chicken and some street corn there. That's looking pretty good. I like this sign here. Here at the empanada stand it says when in doubt taco it out that is pretty good advice can you tell me what all is on this here so this is our tampa roll it's going to have the it's going to have the honey ham with the genoa salami as well as the um, roasted pork it's in the mojo marinade as well so it's got that little bit of a spanish flavor to it and it's going to have the mince pickles with the the Swiss cheese and then our Tampa Girl sauce. She recommended I use a little bit of this hot sauce that's sweet and spicy. But well, we are going to try Ampa Mama's signature empanada, which is called Tampa Girl. She tried to explain everything that was in it. I got a little bit of that sweet, uh, sweet and spicy sauce that she recommended. We're going to try that. And we're going to find out. We're going to break into this. Well, people are lining up here at Ampa Mama's and uh, getting some food and uh, it's getting busy in here. Well, I have took one big bite out of this and all the different meat inside this, it's very good. It's very good indeed. I haven't tried the sauce yet, but I'm going to. This is very, very good. I have tried the, uh, the sauce. It says sweet and spicy, but it is not that spicy at all. It is it's right on target. I like it. And I don't like real spicy, but this is it's just a hint of spice. And it's rather sweet. Out here on the waterfront area of Armature Works, they have a little game area where you could play some chess or checkers, I guess, in life form. That's pretty cool that so you can come out here and do that. And they have these pretty cool little patio furniture sitting out here as well. And it's right along the Hillsborough River which is pretty cool. They're still renovating. They're still working on some of this back, back through here. All kinds of chairs here for you to sit and relax.
enjoyed my visit here at Tampa Armature Works. Uh, it's down here in the Heights District, and it used to be a, uh, a building that housed the Tampa uh, electric streetcars way back in the day. And they have refurbished this. This opened back in December of 2017, and they're still growing. They're still adding more shops uh, and more uh, places to eat and uh, kind of a little marketplace. Uh, they had some bakery goods in there and all kinds of, they had flowers you could buy, all kinds of cool things. A great little place to come down and enjoy the afternoon, have lunch, have, uh, have dinner. It's right here on the Hillsborough River, downtown Tampa. Uh, I want to thank the girl at Ampa Mama's for providing me lunch, and I wasn't expecting that, and it was very good. I had the uh, Tampa girl, Ampanata, uh, with the uh, sweet and spicy sauce, and it was not, it was not spicy as you would think. It was very, very good. Uh, I would get it again, uh, and I do appreciate her giving me my lunch for free. I wasn't expecting that. I usually pay for these things, and I don't mind doing that, but I do appreciate it, uh, Ampa Mamas. And uh, if you want to check them out and all the other places, go to the link in the description for um, Armature Works here in Tampa, and they can you can check out everything that they have down here. Appreciate all you subscribers out there. Keep hitting that subscribe button. Uh, appreciate you watching and viewing these videos. Uh, Takes some time to go check these places out. I'm enjoying it. I, uh, it's a hot day today, and uh, but I'm I'll be back again at another time with something different, hopefully. And remember to keep going out there, making it a great day because you deserve it.